Want to turn your blurry or dull photo into high quality eye catching visuals in just one click? Hey everyone, I'm Toshi from Design with Toshi. Today I'm sharing an amazing tool that's perfect for creators, photographers, or literally anyone who wants the studio quality photo edits without learning complex softwares. So if you're ready to take your content to the next level with just few clicks, stick around because I'm gonna show you exactly how it works. This is HitPower Photopea, an innovative, super user-friendly photo enhancer that uses AI to instantly upgrade your images, remove noise, fix blur, and even upscale resolution. And yes, it works like magic. Once you will go to this website, you can simply come over here and you can download the app for your Windows and Mac OS. So right now I'm using Mac OS, so let's get started. So this is the interface of the app. So to enhance any image, you simply have to come over here and click on plus. Once you will do that, your interface will come and here you just have to drop your image and you can start with the process. So here we are having a lot of models according to your need you can select. So first we are having the face model, then upscale model, denoise, sharpen model, text model, animation model, colorize model, low light model, scratch repair, color calibration so you can try all of these so let's try the first one so for that you can click on plus and let's select one image from our library so i'm gonna select my own image for example and click on open once you will do that it will automatically apply the best model combination according to the image and you can cancel that one also but let's see the result first Basically, you can see which are the models which has been applied automatically by this tool. And if you don't want that, you can simply cancel that one. So first we are trying the face model. So it has applied the upscale model. Also. So if you don't want the upscale model, you can simply cancel that one from here. Okay. And next we are having the face model. So in face model, you are having the soft or soft version 2 or sharp option. So you can select as per your need. So let's select the version 2 for now. Okay. After that, once you are done with the selection of the model, you can simply click over here and see the preview. Once you will click on the preview, it will be applied. And now you can see the result. You can see the difference side by side and you can click over here also and you can check before and after like this. So this is after applying the enhancement and this is before. Okay, so you can compare like that one. Otherwise, you can simply click over here and you can see side by side also. Once you are done, you can simply click on export one images and you can download your image and use it. Okay, so this was about the first model. So let's try the different one. So next we are going to try the colorize model where we are going to upload a black and white image from our library and we are going to use that model and see how it is going to give the result. So I'm uploading that image and you can see it is already applying the face model. So if you don't want, so you can simply stop and let's cancel these models. So right now I am not applying any model because I just want to show you that how the colorize model used to work. So let's click on that in colorize model. We are having two options: old photos and black and white. I'm going to select the black and white. So as I told you, after selecting the model, you can click on preview before downloading the image and it will give you the result. So you can see the difference side by side and let's check this out. So you can compare this is before and this is after applying the colorized model. So if you are happy with the result, you can simply click on export one images and you can download it for your use. So this is how the colorized model used to work in HitPower Photo P. So next I'm going to show you how you can try the denoise model. So I'm going to upload one more image with a lot of noise. So I will click over here and I will click on the image. So you can see the image that there is a lot of noise in the image. So I'm not going to select any uh, model. I'm just going to select the denoise from here. And here are two options, creative denoise and realistic denoise. So let's select the realistic denoise for now and let's click on preview. So you can see the difference that this is the image before and after applying the denoise model, it has removed the noise from your image and it is giving you this result. So you can check the difference over here like this. This is before 
and this is after applying the denoise model which is really great so you can zoom also and check the difference side by side so this is before and this is after so next i'm gonna show you the example of animation models this model is basically for the images like uh, anime character or something so let's click on plus and upload our anime image we'll click on stop because i don't want to apply anything you can definitely apply the upscale or anything but i'm just showing you the example that after applying the animation model what exactly you are going to get so i have applied and now i will click on preview and here is the result you can see the difference side by side or click over here and check before and after so this is the image before and after applying the animation model it has given you this result which is really great so you can use this animation model for your anime character and upscale your image apart from enhancement this ai tool is having a lot of other ai features so you can try it out so let me show you a few of them so first is ai image generator so let's generate an image from here so they are having a lot of template also which you can definitely try but over here we are having text to image and image to image option so let's click on text to image and here let's write down the prompt and after writing your prompt you can simply click on model and select the model as per your need so they are having different model like flux one or a stable diffusion and they are having the templates also which you can try so let's select the flux one and here are the general settings that number of images so how many images you want so it is automatically four so it will give you four results and here you can select the image size so let's select the size of it so right now i'm selecting three is to four and after that click on generate so the ai has generated the image you can simply click over here and check the results so this is image number one this is two this is three and this is four which is really amazing i love the quality of the images over here so you can simply click on download and download and use it for later so next we are going to try the beautiful feature that is face swap so let's click over here so here you need the original image and the target image so suppose this is my original image i want to swap my face with this face okay so after selecting the original image i will click on target image and here i will click on add face and in add face i will select my face from the gallery suppose i am selecting my face i will click on open as you can see it has detected my face so after that i will click on swap and wait for some time we have successfully swapped the face and you can check that my face is here so you can definitely try this feature so hit power photo p is having a different other features also so you can definitely try them out and create something amazing and upscale your image as per your need and that's how simple it is to enhance your images with hit power photo p whether you are a beginner or a pro this tool makes advanced image editing super easy and accessible if you want to try it out i have added the link in the description go check it out and give your visuals the boost they deserve if you found this helpful don't forget to like comment and subscribe for more amazing content i am toshik and i will see you in the next one